Hey guys, August here from Airsoft and More, and today we have another gas blowback review. This is going to be the review of the KWA KZ61 Scorpion submachine gun. So KWA is known for making one of the best gas blowbacks on the market, as well as the most unique Airsoft replicas, including the MP7, KMP9, MAC-11, and this new one right here, which is the Scorpion. So before they released the gas blowback Scorpion, you could really find this in the AEG model, but now that KWA came out with this thing, you now have the awesome gas blowback version of our favorite Czech submachine gun. So let's go over the features and see how it shoots. All right, so going over the features of this gun, we have a full metal outer barrel up front and we have this folding stock that you can just pop off folds nicely to the rear your receiver is full metal upper and lower you have these circular ambidextrous charging handles also you have your mag release on this side including a selector switch that has both semi safe and full auto it seems like the only plastic or polymer components of this weapon is the grip all right, going over the magazine, it comes with a 20 round standard capacity magazine, but there is the optional 40 round extended mag for the KZ-61 right now. If you wanted to flip the stock back to its original position, all you do is pinch the rear and it locks into the front sight right here, nice and neat. So now that we went over the features of this gun, let's chrono it, shoot it, and see how it performs. Alright guys, this will be the chrono test of the KZ-61 Scorpion using 0.20 gram KWA Premium BBs and a fully charged green gas mag. Let's check out the results. Cock it. All right, so this gun is performing in the 300 area. I got a few shots that are in the, uh, um, you know, around 320 or so, but all of them under 350, great for CQB. All right, guys, and this is gonna be the full auto mag dump. Alright, so in summary, this is another unique submachine gun by KWA. KWA is known for releasing all of the unique submachine guns, so I'm excited to see what they have next. Maybe an Uzi, something of that sort. Um, I really like how the Scorpion flows in your hand. You could comfortably use two hands to fire it. Me, personally, I have the KWA Mac 11, and I find it very hard to hold with two hands, kind of... Uh, unstable one-handed weapon, but um, the Scorpion right here, your hand just naturally contours around the front mag grip and it just it just holds really nicely. It has a really nice rate of fire and the blowback, like all KWA guns, is really crisp. So again guys, thanks for watching the video. If you want to check out the gun, check it out on our website at airsoftandmore.com or come in store and fire this awesome submachine gun. So thanks again guys for watching our video. This is August from Airsoft and More signing off. Yeah, man.